The St. Louis Rams are at odds of 50-1 to to win the Super Bowl, and their season win total sits at 8. Last season saw the Rams go 6-10 straight up and 7-9 against the spread, with the team going over the total in 8 games and under in 8. Hopes are high again this year for the St. Louis Rams, but this time the team will not be relying on quarterback Sam Bradford as they traded him to Philadelphia for Nick Foles. The team should be better off with Foles as he is more likely to stay healthy and provide consistent play. Head coach Jeff Fisher said, We felt like he really fits into our style of offense, the mobility, the athleticism, and he loves to put it down the field. The Rams rolled the dice in the NFL draft and took running back Todd Gurley, who could be a future superstar if he is healthy. The Rams play in one of the toughest divisions in the NFL, in the NFC West, but they have a very good defense, and if Gurley is as good as advertised and full plays well, the team could be in the playoffs in 2015. The Rams were a mess last season after Bradford got hurt as they simply couldn't get any consistent quarterback play. The team was tired of hoping that Bradford could stay healthy, so they traded for Nick Foles in the offseason. He played well in Philadelphia, and there is no doubting his toughness. He does have some weapons around him as well, including rookie Todd Gurley, who is considered one of the best running back prospects since Adrian Peterson. The team may have to rely on Trey Mason until Gurley is up to full speed. The concern for the offense is the line, as both Jake Long and Joseph Barksdale are gone. The team badly needs Greg Robinson, who was the number two pick last year in the draft, to step forward. The team does have a good tight end in Jared Cook, but they have some weaknesses at receiver. They really need former first-round pick Tavon Austin to play well. The Rams have an excellent defense, led by perhaps the best defensive line in the game. They have defensive rookie of the year Aaron Donald, joined by Robert Quinn, Chris Long, and Michael Brockers. They also added Nick Fairley to join those four. The linebackers are just average, led by James Laurinaitis and Alec Ogletree. It could be that Akeem Ayers, who came over from New England, gets a starting spot. The secondary is led by strong safety TJ McDonald. The Rams have the potential to be a playoff team in 2015, but they need Gurley to be a factor, and they need Foles to avoid making mistakes. The division might not be quite as tough in 2015, as the 49ers look a bit weaker, so for our pick and prediction, We'll look for the Rams to win nine games and be a playoff contender. Join us at BetDSI.com for the best St. Louis Rams betting options, including futures, props, and live in-progress betting during the games.